A debate rages across this country. It's on the best way to teach reading. At the middle of this debate are the students, your students, who desperately need the skills associated with reading, not only to succeed in school, but in life. There are over 7 million students in grades 6 through 12 that are reading two or more grades below level. As a result, these struggling readers have little chance of passing content area classes or graduating from high school. Teachers and educational leaders are scrambling to meet the needs of their students, as well as the concerns of parents and policymakers. But reading is more than simply decoding words, more than a score or a standardized test. These measurements matter, but ultimately, as all teachers know, if students cannot read on grade level, there is little chance of academic or professional success. In addition, many middle and high schools are experiencing an influx of English language learners. Unfortunately, many of these students are barely literate in their native language. This, compounded with their lack of English, creates significant potential for school failure. The challenge can seem daunting, even overwhelming, but there are effective solutions that have been proven to work. Literacy First is a comprehensive reading reform process. However, more than simply reading, Literacy First speaks to all facets of learning, facilitating comprehension and accelerating student achievement. What this means is that for your school, classroom, and each student, Literacy First is more than a program. It is a comprehensive reform process complete with tools, on-site training and consulting, assessments, and methods to accelerate reading achievement and ensure increased student achievement in all content area classes. The Literacy First process for middle and high school has a two-pronged approach, the intensive reading process and the content area process. The intensive reading process works with designated teachers to improve understanding of how to teach critical reading skills as well as processes to accelerate reading achievement by as much as three years growth in one school year. The process includes using formative reading assessment data to drive instruction, structuring reading lessons to ensure students are taught in a systematic and explicit manner, identifying the resources and materials necessary to effectively implement an intensive reading process, and using learning stations to reinforce reading skills and processes. Literacy First is customized to your specific needs. It's not a one-size-fits-all program. Working with your teachers and building administrators, Literacy First creates an effective plan for accelerating student reading achievement. Here's how it works. The building principal identifies specific teachers to be trained in the Literacy First intensive reading process. Also, the principal creates a schedule for intensive reading classes of 90 minutes, five days per week, with a 20 to 1 student-teacher ratio. Over a three-year period, the specifically identified teachers will receive 13 days of research-based professional development to enable them to become secondary reading specialists. In addition to the professional development, each school receives up to 24 coaching and consulting visits over a three-year period. These visits support and monitor the intensive reading teachers as they go about implementing the Literacy First process to accelerate student reading achievement. Literacy First has just been phenomenal at Seabury Middle School. The teachers, it's enriched the teachers as far as professional development. They have engaging activities in their classroom and children are learning to read and the data doesn't lie. Our FCAT data was phenomenal for our students, especially our students, struggling students in the lowest quartile. The Literacy First intensive reading process is proven and works. Highlands County, Florida accelerated student reading achievement by as much as three years growth in one year on the reading portion of the Florida Comprehensive Achievement Test. In Lake County, Florida, Mount Dora Middle School has 71 percent and Eustis Middle School had 75 percent of their students move out of the bottom quartile on the same state assessment. Increasing student achievement in all content area classes is the focus of the second prong of the Literacy First process. Essential to achieving and sustaining academic growth is teaching for real comprehension with every student across the school in all content area classes. The Literacy First Consultant works to build the capacity of the content area teachers 
and building leadership team to ensure a significant increase in student achievement. To start the process, content area teachers voluntarily participate in five days of content area professional development spread out during the school year. Within three years, all the content area teachers in the school will have participated in the training. The content area professional development includes how to structure lessons to ensure that students are taught in a systematic and explicit manner, instructional strategies to fully engage every student in the active manipulation of the content presented, instructional strategies to significantly increase student vocabulary, comprehension strategies that are customized to meet the needs of content area instruction, strategic reading thinking tools that are customized to meet the needs of content area instruction, and strategies to cause students to be metacognitive about the content presented. Over the course of the three-year process, the Literacy First Consultant provides up to 24 coaching consulting days to the school. The purpose of these days is to support and monitor the content area teachers as they go about implementing the Literacy First process to significantly increase student achievement in all content area classes. It is this commitment to ensuring your success that separates Literacy First from any other program. It is truly a team effort. The process is proven and achieves results. Warden School District in Washington State achieved a phenomenal 26% increase of students passing the Washington Assessment of Student Learning after only one year of implementing the Literacy First content area process. And Guilford County, North Carolina achieved a 90% increase of students passing the Advanced Placement Exam with a score of three or higher. Every Literacy First school participates in the annual Leadership Institute. This two-day seminar focuses on the research-based best practices to strengthen leadership skills of the building leadership team. The support that I receive from my administration and my Literacy First resource teacher is tremendous. Um, they're completely behind the process, which is important. They totally believe in the process because they've seen the results. So anytime that I need anything from my administrator or my Literacy First resource teacher, they're right there, they're educated about it, they're ready to help me even come in and co-teach with me or do a demonstration lesson so that I always have someone there who's ready to help me and lead me through the process. Literacy First partners with you to prepare students for the 21st century. With the successful implementation of the Literacy First process, teachers focus on accelerating student learning in reading and in all content area classes. Students are taught to be idea managers, creative and innovative in their own learning. Despite language, class or background, the challenge is no longer daunting, no longer overwhelming. Step by step with the proven, dynamic and customized process of Literacy First, you can accelerate the achievement of each and every student. Collaborating with Literacy First turns the challenge into a realized dream for success for every student.